Lisa on the Tom Likas Show. Hello. I'm here. Well, just for the, just that, the last caller just tops it all. I mean, he's saying how his poor brother got this girl pregnant. Well, come on. Who's the idiot here, really? Poor him. He, he now has this debt. Well, he should have kept it in his pants. Adair, uh, people don't keep it in their pants. They have sex. That's what people do. Then they need to be more responsible. Well, I agree. I, I, you should certainly wear a condom. But uh, uh, in addition, we have a society where women are legally permitted to lie about being on birth control. And that's oh. what happened in that case. Oh, but so a man does not... Do, the man only thinks with one thing? Uh, uh, actually, that's the only... Uh, dear, I, I'm, I'm going to bring you a little news bulletin here. What's that? That's the only reason we talk to you is because you've got a vagina. Oh, tell me about it. But then they All right, well, that's it. So, you, so, I mean, that's it. Case closed. They gripe that, oh, no, she's pregnant now. Oh, no. Notice the fact that I brought up the fact that she had uh, lied about birth control. You don't even deal with that. You just ignore that fact. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but then that's what he gets. But, oh, but you see, that's what I'm saying. You, th you say that men uh, should get uh, screwed over by women who are legally allowed to commit fraud. Oh. Well, how about a man when they say they're sterile? Uh, that's fraudulent also. And okay. you know, I, by the way, uh, I don't think that should be legal either. Well, and it isn't it. It is. Well, it shouldn't be. You should not be able to defraud anybody about your uh, ability to have children. And uh, I, I think that uh, that should be actionable. I think that if the man does not, because every time they have a relationship, there's always that possibility. Mistakes happen. No, then no, no, but dear, we're not talking about mistakes are one thing. When somebody lies and says they're on birth control when they're not, that's fraud. Oh, well, definitely. That's not a mistake. That's intentional. But he needs to take responsibility for himself. Uh, th th still, uh, the fact is that you don't want to get involved with a single mother. Because single mothers do these kinds of things. Oh, but why... why so, therefore, why? I'm just telling the guys the surest way to stay away from this kind of trouble is not to have sex with a single mother. Not to date her, not to take her kids to Disneyland, none of it. Now how, now how is that nowadays when everybody comes from broken homes? Everybody doesn't. Possible. Everybody, everybody doesn't. Everybody, the, the majority of society nowadays are from broken homes. It doesn't matter. The point is everybody doesn't have children. Everybody run, doesn't. You're going to run into... I don't have children. You're going to run into someone that has at least one child. Maybe you have children you don't even know about. You, you, again, if you know they have children, Stay away. Well, I agree. I agree, but it's gonna good. Well, I'm glad we it's agree. Gonna, it's going to get harder and harder as time goes on. Well, no. If, I, if my boys stay away from single mothers, there'll be less and less of them. Well, how about what about the men also? Poor women don't get involved with the men that have. We had this conversation already. Oh yeah, we did. But the fact the fact that I hear these men griping and complaining how they're victims they're not victims they are victims no they're not yes they are even, even if they're yes, they are victims I mean just like if you were in a car accident and uh, you hadn't maintained your brakes and you skidded into a wall and you became, became a quadriplegic you'd be a victim even if it was your fault you didn't maintain the brakes you'd be an accident victim these guys are victims no I, I, I disagree I disagree because either way an accident an accident can These are not accidents we're talking about. Okay, but everything These are plots by women to take our money. Things can be avoided. These are plots by women to take our money. So These are not accidents. There are no accidents. When a woman has a baby, it's because she chose to have one. There are no accidents. Men then can't think for themselves. Men then can't make those decisions. Men can't take care of themselves. Is that what you're Men saying? don't have the right to make those decisions. Women have the right to make those decisions. The, the, the right to choose belongs only to women, not to men. Oh, no, but it takes two. No, it doesn't. And it's a big it doesn't. It doesn't. Because if a woman becomes pregnant and the man doesn't want to have a baby, it doesn't take two to make that decision. It takes one. The woman gets to make it. The man does not get to make it. No, it takes two to make the problem. Uh, no. No, dear. No, dear. Because, again, uh, women have 12 different forms of birth control available to them. They also have morning after pill, RU486, and abortion. If a baby is born, it's because the woman chose to have the baby. And if a woman chose to lie about birth control so she can get knocked up by a particular guy, it's because she wants to take his money. But you're saying it's it's always the woman's responsibility then. I'm it's saying not. that is the woman's fault. No. no yes, it's it is. Not. It's not. Because yes, it is. A baby is not born because a man forces you to have a baby. It is a woman's choice. But the thing is, at the same time when it's happening, the man also needs to realize, you know what, she could be lying to me. I you tell the boys that, but that doesn't mean they're not victims when some bitch lies. 
Well, I don't know. I think that the ones that call and they complain and they complain about how, how they've been victimized are just dumbasses, I think. Because they need to realize that that it takes two. There, you're now you're repeating your material. Thank you. Dumb like it. 1-800-5800-TOM. Dumb like it. 1-800-5800-866. You have a nice rack? I do. How nice is it? I'm an A, baby. An A cup. A cheese. More than a mouthful is a waste. Sounds to me like you don't even have a mouthful. The Tom Likas Show.